Gil, so good to see you again. Uh, I know your role. Can you tell everybody else a little bit more about your role and what you do? Yeah, sure. So I'm uh, one of the co-founders and also the chief revenue officer for Cloud Endure. And Cloud Endure, what we do is we help companies move workloads into the cloud. Specifically, uh, we help uh, companies move their workloads into the cloud for the purposes of just staying there or uh, doing disaster recovery. We met around two years ago, I think. You yeah. came in, you did a technical demonstration uh, to our team. Um, and it reminds me of this Arthur C. Clarke quote, the guy who wrote uh, Space Odyssey 2001. Bear with me. Uh, and he talks about any sufficiently advanced technology should be indistinguishable from magic. I remember watching that and saying, wow, that's really impressive. We came out of the room thinking, does that actually work? So can you talk a little bit about that technology, how you actually do what you do and why it's so successful? Yeah, sure. So, so we brought um, something very, uh, very interesting into the into the cloud, which is basically the continuous replication, which replicates all the data into the cloud, as well as something that we called machine conversion, which basically takes any machine and converts it into any cloud machine. So these two together um, make it pretty much, uh, as you said, magic. Because uh, think about it in the old world. They used to take um, other solutions or uh, traditional solutions used to take VMware to VMware or Hyper-V to Hyper-V or other kind of technologies into the same technology while we can take any kind of infrastructure or technology and convert it into a GCP machine. So the, the conversion plus the replication is what, is what makes this uh, magic work basically. Excellent. And, you know, fast forward two years, I know we're running a program together where we're inviting customers to take their VMs and move them over. Can you talk a little bit about that program and some of the successes we've seen? Yeah, sure. So that's really, really amazing, uh, amazing collaboration between um, us and, and you guys and Google. And actually, it's, on, it's not only us and you, but it's also the customers are winning, obviously. So it's, uh, what we have now is Cloudender is basically within the Google Cloud platform. You can basically import machines into GCP uh, while using uh, Cloudender there. Yeah, it's incredible. You know, as you said, it's based out of the console, so you can go in there and say import VM, and that will take you to the Cloud in your side, right. and then you just plug in your VMs. You know. One customer that we can talk about, we're doing a case study together, is a WP in the Netherlands. Um, you know, if you look at the traditional way of doing migrations, that can take several months, lots of scripting, and often the customer's like, too much hassle, I'm going to keep my machines where they are. Can you talk about some of the uh, successes with WP and yeah. what you developed for them? Yeah, sure. So I remember uh, one of the Google reps um, uh, talked to me uh, and said that we have a WP, and we talked, we had a conference call pretty quick after, and I showed him the solution, uh, the person, the CEO, and he was, um, he didn't really believe it could work that easily. Uh, he tested it at the same weekend, and I think that he moved, in two weekends, uh, basically moved 30 machines. Um, he didn't believe it, and after the experience, obviously, he was really, really uh, amazed by the, the technology and the speed. So it, it basically took something like, you know, Something like two days, something that would typically take weeks. Wow. Yeah. So he was able in his weekend, in his spare time, just log in and move those machines over. Yeah, with the click of a button, a couple of minutes, and the machine is over in GCP. Working. Our sales team are really happy. This is the easiest deal I've ever done. The customer's really happy because th what they thought was going to take several months and really expensive, they could do over a weekend. So that's really impressive. Right, and that, they, I mean, that goes on over and over again. We have a lot of customers like that that were really, uh, we have a Turkish co customer that moved like 30 machines in, in two days and was amazed. And we have another uh, customer from other places w which are having the same experience basically, moving uh, machines in, in, a, in a quick, very, very quick time. I'm gonna ask a question I asked earlier. I'm a system integrator. I kind of make money from billing hours. Is this good for me or is this competitive? How do I reconcile the two? So, uh, you know, we think that uh, system integrators, which are basically looking uh, on a very long-term, uh, you know, more a long-term kind of situation versus a short-term, would really, really like our solution. And we see it. We have a lot of system integrators which are working. We have a very large company that we helped in India, a $70 billion company, move workloads uh, with, a, with, a, with a partner, uh, with a system integrator that we, we had 
uh, Google help us do the match there. So the lift and shift is going to be very quick, and then they can focus on other stuff and you know make a lot of money on other stuff. So, so it's still a win-win situation, uh, and you can be much faster than the other system integrators which are doing it manually. It's a very good point. I think what we're recognizing from and we're hearing from our service partners is now they can do projects that previously they didn't have the skills to do. And when they get the customer quickly to do a POC, it's a short time to value, and then they can start to expand. Well, now that we've brought your machines over, what else can we do? Let's right. use more of the Google magic. So right. that's exactly. excellent. And then what do you see as the future in the next couple of years for cloud and Google in particular? I think the disaster recovery is going to be very, very strong, especially in Google, by the way. And I think that the customers will move from a, from a model of disaster recovery as a service using very, um, very um, expensive um, solutions such as, you know, SunGuard and Island and others uh, to going, going to disaster recovery such as Cloud Endure into GCP, which will reduce the cost, have a lot of visibility and a lot of ease of use. And that's one of the things that, will, um, that I think will be very significant in the next few years. Really interesting. Well, I look forward to continuing this partnership and uh, thanks for your time, Gil. Thank you.